Hello, and today we're going to be installing a SSD hard drive inside the Alienware Aurora R11. Here's the inside of the case. Here's the hard drive we actually want to remove. They're mechanical, they're slow. Remove the power connector. Remove the SATA connector. Grab on either side. Hard drive cage. Pops right out like so. We're going to be installing a Crucial MX500 two and a half inch, two terabyte hard drive. Top rated SSDs. They actually go right here. Make sure we get a good look at our hard drive bay. Let's go ahead and take these power cables out of the way. Hard drive bay comes out. We did have to move this uh, power supply mounting bracket up and rerun the SATA data connector so that it could reach. It is held in place by little pins. Don't know if you can see them that well right here. You just had to move those out of the way, rerun the cable to here, and that way we can actually have data for our SATA. And here we have our hard drive installed in the cage. Install it so the label is facing up. This is gonna make it easier to install your power and data connectors. Simply push it into slot till you hear the click. data connector and power connector push that cable out of the way put the locking arm down and you are done well not quite we put up the computer to go Oh my God, where's my shiny new hard drive? No need to panic. We open Device Manager and see that the hard drive is clearly being detected by the system. To initialize the drive, we simply right click, select Initialize Disk, and select GPT as this drive will not be holding an OS, but will be used as a backup data drive. Hit OK. And all we need to do now is a quick format. Since we simply want one big partition, this part is easy peasy. We want a modern NTFS Windows partition, and here we get to name our drive whatever we want. Let's make it a backup drive. I mean, backup drive. Typing is hard. And boom, we are good to go with two terabytes of solid state goodness. Thanks for watching, and if you learned something today, don't forget to like or subscribe.